What's up, people? It's me, Clint, and I'm back again for another Logic Pro tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to reverse audio in Logic Pro, and it's a fairly simple thing to do. Um, I use it sometimes to switch up things in my production and just add a different vibe to a track that I may be working on. Um, so if you don't know how to do it, I'm going to show you how to do it step by step. Um, so yeah, let's dig into it. Now, the first thing is, uh, is very, very critical. If you don't do this, you won't be able to have um, the feature to reverse audio along with some of the other advanced features that you can use in Logic Pro. So the first thing we want to do is go to Logic Pro and go to Preferences, Advanced Tools, click on that. And then you'll see this option that says Show Advanced Tools. You want to make sure that's clicked along with um, all the additional options below. Um, if it's not clicked, it'll pretty much look like this, which if you've ever used GarageBand, it is definitely pretty much GarageBand. Wow, that is, that's weird. Anyways, make sure that's selected and you'll be good to go. Now we want to drag in some audio. Or you can bounce an audio file within, you know, from your MIDI files, however you're working in Logic. Um, for the sake of the tutorial, I'm going to just drag in some audio that's ready to go. Um, so this is the loop that we have here. It's a piano loop. Okay, so that's the loop. Now we want to reverse it, switch things up a little bit. So let's double click the file and then this little window will pop up. You have two options here. You have the file and then you have the track tab. You want to make sure you're under the file tab and then you'll have a functions uh, button or menu over here. Click on that, scroll down to reverse. Voila, you just reversed audio. So let's play it, see what it sounds like. There you have it, reversed piano loop. It's pretty dope, right? Um, again, I use it in my production to, to switch things up and just add a different vibe to the track. And it works really well and it's super easy to do. So why not do it? Uh, if you like the video, definitely like, share, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.